Hey guys, it's Justin MT88. So, um, um, this tutorial, I will show you how to solder the, um, one of the Bachman Easy Track rail joiners. So, um, so, the, the, the only, the one of the, the one of the bottom needs to check if you if you, if you run around with the curt radius curves like this, the only problem is is that it's that it keeps wiggling and keeps warping, so it'll have a tendency to derail or losing the electric losing the sense of, losing the sense the ability of electric electrical pickup. So um so. I will show you how to solder solder this this rail against the rail joiner. So um so all right. The tools that you will acquire is this flux paste soldering paste. Your solder and the soldering iron. So so. Okay, I'm going to take a little bit of soldering paste. No need to put too much, just a little bit. Okay. For that, you take the soldering iron. Kind of gently melt the flex. Okay. Okay. The soldering. This takes. Takes some time to practice. All right. Move some of the corrosion here. Gotta do the other side. It's important that you do not solder the inside of the rail joiners because if you do that, it'll have a tendency to derail or fall down on a fall down and it'll break. It'll break your uh, one of the detail locomotive and freight freights passengers and freights all that stuff. You so you don't want that to solder the inside. Only to solder on the outside of the rail joiner. So. So I'm going to repeat the same thing as I did. So just take Okay. Put that down. Melt the flux. Very, very careful. Okay. I got it right. There you go. Always tight.
Looks pretty good. Okay. That's going to be the end of this tutorial about how to solder the Bachman Easy Track rail joiners. So it will allow to have electrical pickup on the so that it could have a locomotive, it could run, it can have look so, so my locomotives could run and run on electric pickups. So, electric pickup rail joiners. So, all right, if you have any questions, please comment, subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.